Please have a seat and listen to my story. It's not about my best of time and or of all my glory. This story is about a man trying to live the simple life. Like most, making myself available for my future wife. As part of life, I went through the dating game. Being away from the game for so long. It's just not the same. But there was this one woman that did catch my eye, having me to believe that I finally snatched my pride. She possessed a beauty that song was written about, mesmerizing me to a point I felt like a Cub Scout. The maturity of this woman were higher than all the rest. Can't match my conversation is what I love the best. It never occurred to me to ask her about her past. So sure I made the correct choice. Didn't realize I was moving too fast. It was she who volunteered to always go, capturing my heart. She knew what it took. Coming home each day to a nice clean home, thanking the Lord for not leaving me alone. Being so in love with this woman, I took her to my bank, gave total access to my account, my way of showing my thanks. Managing the house, household bill, and also knew how to invest. With a woman like her, I knew I'd been blessed. But the reality of life smacked me so hard in my face When one day I came home to an empty place What I didn't know was this was part of her M.O. Didn't know until the FBI sent me the latest memo The memo showed that I was number seven on her list. She would look for established men who would be gullible enough to fall for her after she plants a sensual kiss. After she cleans you out, she simply just move on. Set up camp in another town, searching for another gullible John. It's not about the taking of the material thing. It's about what she leaves behind after her well thought out state. What she left behind with me is no more morning glory. Instead, I'm sitting here with you, telling you my story.